everyone, and welcome back to Planet Zoo. As always, I'm Reckless, and today in our next episode of our Calgary Zoo Reimagined series, this is going to be our pronghorn desert habitat. And uh, the reason why we decided to do this in kind of a desert ha- style is uh, I've never done it before. <laughs> you know, it's my first kind of a uh, desert lowlands style uh using like the cacti and stuff like that i've never used these assets before so we decided why not uh throw this into the calgary zoo reimagined series uh i don't believe the calgary zoo has pronghorn but they do have different kinds of deer which this game doesn't have as of yet so we decided in the place of the deer we'd have the pronghorn because they are native to north america and uh, all the way down into like Mexico and stuff like that as well. So we decided to do this again as more of a uh, Mexican Sonora desert, maybe Arizona kind of thing, as opposed to like the plains and of Alberta and uh, Montana and stuff like that. Uh, I apologize for the delay in this video. I've had it edited and cut and everything ready to go for about a week now, but I just haven't been able to record my voice. Uh, for the first couple days, there was construction going on at my condo, like non-stop. Uh, I think it's the either the floor below me, like the people right below me, or like one, one door over, but they're doing some heavy duty construction and it's just the loudest thing ever. And then uh, after that, I've, once they finally stopped doing that, uh, I went out for a night with a couple buddies of mine, and uh, I got sick. First night out in like three months, and I catch uh, something, you know? What are the odds of that, right? So I had a heck of a fever for a couple days, and uh, my throat, I, I'm sure you can hear it, is still on the mend a little bit, but uh, it, I could barely talk for a couple days. Absolute chainsaw just ripping through my throat. So I, I do apologize for the delay on this video, but this is the first day that I, I feel my voice is up to recording at all. So I hope you guys enjoy it, though it, it is a, the first time we've done any sort of uh, Desert Lowlands build on the channel. Uh, so I hope you guys like the design I went with here. Again, this was recorded live over on Twitch.tv. Uh, I will be setting up a, a more reliable twitch uh streaming schedule in the upcoming weeks uh in the next week or so i should be getting the go ahead to go back to work here thankfully finally right so i basically just have to wait and see how my schedule uh turns out at my work in order to figure out when would be the most ideal time to uh stream for both the viewers and myself so either way uh, make sure to join our Discord if you haven't already. You can keep up to date with when I'm going live. Or you can just simply give us a follow over at twitch.tv slash reckless1gaming. And that way anytime I go live you will be notified as such. And you can pop in and say hello. I think these Calgary Zoo builds have been going uh, pretty well actually. You know we, we've been having a lot of fun uh, with the chat. Uh, having people able to give me pointers and hints. And uh, like... Reminding to put water in our pronghorn habitat so our animals don't die. <laughs> that might have been a thing. As you saw in the video, as soon as I put that water in, they all kind of just sprinted over to it. Uh, yeah, I, I swear I, I'm not mean to my animals, guys. It, it was an uh, honest mistake. But all in all, I've had a ton of fun building this zoo. Again, this is a reimagined series in a world where uh, the Calgary Zoo has unlimited funds. I, th this is the way that I envision they would design their habitats and stuff like that. So I've taken a bit of creative freedom on the habitats. But we are trying to keep the buildings as uh, true to form as possible, which is certainly creating some challenges for our upcoming section. We've decided to do the Africa section next. And the African section in the Calgary Zoo has two giant buildings. They have an Africa savanna building and then an African rainforest building. Basically, the uh, savanna has like a hippo and giraffe 
and a meerkat, which the Planet Zoo doesn't have a meerkat yet. Fingers crossed, hopefully soon. But uh, the hippo and giraffes share a uh, habitat in this one large building. And then the rainforest is a massive, massive building with like a, a glass, uh, a multi-tiered glass uh, roof. And they've got gorillas in there, waterfalls, a bunch of tropical birds and stuff. It's a really cool building. But recreating it in game is going to be an absolute nightmare for me. So wish me luck. If you want to see me suffer, <laughs> you know, you know where to find me. All of the Calgary Zoo builds will be done uh, on stream, so you guys can all watch it happen live. Watch me struggle uh, as far as building, recreating these buildings. I think when you're building a building from scratch, it's already challenging enough to be like creative and stuff, but when you're trying to recreate something that already exists using the limitations of the game and stuff like that, it's, it's quite challenging, you know, and it's certainly not something that I've completely got the hang of and mastered so it's fun to watch you know it's fun to struggle though you know like nobody wants to just be an expert at a game right off the bat so as you can see in this habitat we went a little bit overboard on the plants but uh, you know I've never used any of these assets before like I said previously and I think they just look so cool like these I think they're called yucca yucca plants and like Joshua trees and cacti and stuff like that it's just super cool assets and I'd like to do a desert theme build in the future after having done this one I think it'd be really nice to do like in a desert biome but that is definitely something for the future as I said in a previous video, I do have a video coming out soon for our Asia Sombad Zoo series. I haven't forgotten about that series, but it's again another recreation of a building that actually exists in the real world. So I'm trying to do it justice and uh, do a, a nice recreation of it, but also challenge my building skills a little bit as well. So it's taken me a while. With getting sick and everything like that and uh, just life in general being a mess right now, you know, my schedules are all messed up. But I do promise you guys that in the next uh, couple weeks, couple months, my schedules will be returning to normal and I will hammer out a more reliable schedule for content for you guys. I don't like to keep you guys waiting and I don't like to be without you guys as well. You know, I, I like to read your comments on the videos, see how many likes we get and everything. So on this video, if you guys could hit a like goal of, you know, let's say 25 likes, you know, I, I never really ask for like goals. So if you guys could hit 25 likes on this video, show me that you guys are enjoying the series. That would be fantastic. Uh, show me that my work is not in vain. We've got a lot of uh, new subscribers in the last couple weeks. So welcome to everyone who is new. If you're not a subscriber as of yet, please do hit, consider hitting that button. You'll uh, keep up to date as I release new content. And going forward, we got a couple series on the go. I think you'll like what we have to show you. Other than that, I will see you guys all in the next one. I'll leave you guys with some cinematics as per usual. And uh, that's all for now. Okay, bye-bye.